Yo Michael here the Carpanet TV so our content for today is all about checking the app sensor or the APP sensor the accelerator pedal position sensor using the um, launch export 31 pro 3 version 2.0 By the way, what is an accelerator pedal position sensor? An app sensor monitors the position of the throttle pedal and sends an electric signal to open the throttle body as a driver depress the gas pedal or the accelerator pedal. So meaning to say, an app sensor is what we call the drive-by-wire system which uh, no longer use a linkage or an accelerator cable. So an app sensor's um, DTC code or generic code is P0122, P2121, or P2138, okay? So which causes the engine to, number one, cause the engine to go into failsafe mode. So when failsafe mode is deactivated, when there is a, a trouble happens in the engine, a failsafe mode will be activated by the computer so what does it mean so this uh, mode or basic mode uh, feature will uh, the vehicle's features will become limited or most specifically the speed of the car will be reduced okay number two p0121 code happens to our engine so causes drive issues for example um, lack of acceleration inconsistent also inconsistent acceleration happens three high idle or sometimes rough idle or rough idling and number four backing or jerking so which causes poor automatic transmission shifting or sometimes it jerks when depressing the pedal then number five it limits the speed okay because appeal seat mode will uh, be activated and then number six stalling okay so there will be sudden or slowing or stopping of your engine so in this video um, car pundits is i'm gonna be showing you um, how to uh, or what to do when a this code happens so if there is a check engine on your dashboard so of, of course we will scan and document the code and then when scanning we will also um clearing the uh, obd2 faults and also re retesting okay so what you are gonna be seeing on this video is i'm gonna be de demonstrating on how to check the percentage value of an app sensor okay so stay tuned and um i hope you will enjoy in this video and i hope you will gain some knowledge on this video okay so before that if you are not subscribed to my channel so please subscribe do subscribe and uh, like and share my video if you think that my video is um, very helpful okay and also click the notification bell so that you will be updated on the future uploads okay so uh, next we will uh, conduct a test um, a somewhat a performance test whether or not our acceleration uh, position sensor or our accelerator pedal assembly is working properly with the use of the scan tool so we will check the percentage of a of the accelerator position sensor whether or not we will if we will accelerate whether or not it will uh, um, fluctuate or it will give its percentage of angle or uh, acceleration okay so with the use of this um, scan tool okay i'm gonna be using a launch scan tool so first up so turn off the uh from starting when the engine is turned off or when the switch, ignition switch is turned off so I'm gonna be plugging out the DLC connector or the Bluetooth connector okay so then next stop is I will uh, click on or push the uh, app 
uh, launch X431 Pro up and then I'll turn on the, the ignition switch and I'll select Asian and select Toyota and then confirm sorry about the noise in the manual we will select powertrain uh, the ACT so I here uh, I will make uh, also I will select the uh, some informations or data values that will be used to compare for our acceleration position so we again uh, we will wait for the scan tool or Bluetooth scan tool to communicate and I will select manual select and press OK then I'll choose NDE because this uh, vehicle or engine is in NDE. Okay, multi mode. Corolla, and then I will uh, check first um, a system scan. So, right now it's because this is a um, simulator, so um, we can only use engine and ECT, but on the manual uh, that I have presented, we have some. Um, other PCM so now only we can use engine and ECT but we can use some of the data values that we can uh, also check so I will check first uh, wait for codes okay so we will delete this one clear code memory so we can go to um, Reading the data stream, especially the okay, I will go in detail, especially the accelerator position sensor. Okay, so then we'll go read read data stream. So we can do this one, even if you you are uh, running the engine or um, when the engine is on idle or uh, sorry um, turn off. Okay, so all data stream. But for me, I, I, I prefer to select first before I uh, do the um, checking the data value. So, of course, number one here is the accelerator position sensor, ambient temperature, the common rail pressure, then maybe engine speed. So, what else? And the map, we will see also the map. Ah. Now, I will start the engine. And then I will press confirm. So let's see what happens. Okay, so here we have here acceleration position sensor zero. Acceleration position zero. Ambient temperature is 20 degrees. Common rail pressure is 48 megapascal. Engine speed is 817, 18 fluctuating revolution per minute. Then we will run the engine and we will accelerate we will see if our acceleration position we will see if the uh, accelerator pedal acceleration position is doing good right so we can we can we, we must see a percentage of value here on the on our accelerator position okay i will accelerate so right now i cannot accelerate to 100 percent but i'll just uh, accelerate uh, at least a mid a median value. Okay, so there is an increasing when I accelerate. So meaning to say, accelerate and release. Okay, so th those values are very important to check if our accelerator position is doing okay. okay. And by the way, uh, Car Pundit, so if you are doing this test or performance test, so try holding the throttle to see if you get steady reading, okay? If reading suddenly drops while holding the pedal, it may indicate a fault with the sensor. Okay, so try to check that out, um, car pundits. So after that, if there is no uh, uh, good reading of the values, then we can proceed to inspection or checking. Okay, to see if whether or not uh, there is an open open circuit connection, uh, open circuit or short circuit or uh, malfunction. Um, sensor or uh, connector or yeah okay so again okay 
Okay, so thank you.